Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Um, I know that a lot of people probably won't be on the app today. They'll probably be with friends and family, and good for you. That's what you should do. Um, but unfortunately, there's individuals like me who just due to our living situations, work situations, um, we won't be able to see our family on Thanksgiving. But that's fine, because, you know, we live in an era where you can call anyone anytime you want. You can FaceTime, you can Discord, you can Skype. So it's not like you just absolutely can't see them. But it also kind of makes you wish that you could be there in person. Um, I know I probably won't see my family until January, February, get through the uh, holiday season just due to work restrictions. Uh, But I want to just talk today about some of my good memories with specifically my sisters uh, through some of the figures I have because it seems like appropriate time to do it. When I was thinking about making this video, this was the first figure that came to mind. This is a Daniel Bryan that came out of some random WWE blind bag. Um, But one year for Christmas, this was the only gift I got. It was from my sister Hattie, and I still love it. It stays on my wrestling shelves with my other figures. Speaking of Christmases, these were the first Transformers I ever had. Titanium Smokescreen and Titanium Bumblebee. Um, And both of them were gifts from my sisters. We used to save up our allowances and get each other small gifts for Christmas, um, and I I lost these guys, unfortunately. I recently got new figures of them, uh, and it's nice to have them back, because I do have good memories. Let's talk about good memories. This is a Kirishima that I bought the first time I ever came down to Savannah, when I was still just kind of wanting to get a feel for SCAD and figure out if I want to go down here. My sister Hattie helped find this guy for me at a GameStop, so... Uh, not only did I get one of my favorite My Hero characters, it's also a nice memory I had going around the city with Hattie. With Ella, a lot of my more cherished childhood memories come from playing video games with her. Um, and for instance, one of my favorite games as a kid was WWE All-Stars. Ella would play that with me all the time, and her favorite person to play as was Bret Hart. Um, mostly because he wore the pink. We were very young at the time. Um... But it's also what gave me my love of Bret Hart, is just finding out more about him because Ella played with him so often. So, there's a lot of good connections that come from that. The first fighting game I ever bought was Mortal Kombat vs. DC, and we spent hours playing that, but Ellen Hattie would always play as Wonder Woman, which was mostly just because they knew who Wonder Woman was, but it's also just a good touchstone for me. Years later, when Injustice came out, that introduced Hattie to her two favorite superheroes, Nightwing and Damian Wayne. And, like I said, it's just good memories, man. Happy Thanksgiving.